there was a there was a colleague that worked with me that was very community minded, and he said, "Well, why don't you go work for Ken at New York Cares, and see what that's like?" So I went and ran the corporate community program at New York Cares, and then reapplied, and I spent the year. I worked also for Women's World Banking, which was run by a Harvard MBA, Nancy Berry, and this world of micro enterprise and converging business putting some small amount of capital in the hands of women to who are known to reinvest their, their themselves and their income in their families and as a mechanism out of poverty, um, reinforce the fact that business can be a source of good. And then Harvard MBA, Harvard MBA, the mission of Harvard is to to help develop leaders that make a difference in the world. And and they're sincere about that. You know, my my business school class had a number of teachers. We had Olympic athlete. We, my husband ended up finding my husband at Harvard. He was a Marine. Um, he and I were in the same section. Yes, it was predominantly still people going into finance and consulting, and but many entrepreneurs and a number of people that were going into other sectors. And the business school had a social enterprise program. So they were putting their money behind their mouth with, where case studies on places like Teach for America, a, a, a club, People that decided that they wanted to go directly into nonprofit could get could get their income matched after business school. So even though I didn't go directly to nonprofit straight from business school, I still spent 15 plus years going into corporate. I saw a pathway of how the combination of business skills and unfortunately even the credibility that sometimes from, comes from playing in those sandbox and the contacts that you make and the connections that you make could could help me be a better, better difference.